Do you and mind if I record this? Hmm? I have a YouTube channel. Yeah, really? Is it okay if I record? <laughs> yes, you can record. Okay, hi, this is Anna here. Um, so tell me, what's the name of the cane again? Uh, we walk. We walk. Yes, we walk. Do you mind if I say it in Spanish Capi. and then you tell me in English? Yes. yes. Okay. Hola, chicos. Ana, aquí estoy en la convención y tengo aquí enfrente la compañía. So, what's the name of the company? We walk. La compañía se llama We Walk. Nosotros caminamos y aquí está el bastón. So, the name of the cane is. We walk. Okay, el nombre del bastón es We Walk. So let's go for a walk. <laughs> y me está enseñando el bastón, el que tiene vibración y está muy bonito. So can you describe this for me? So what, what en la parte de arriba del mango tiene una parte gruesa. There's a touch pad here. Tiene una un touch pad. Mm -hmm. Eso and para... then you can manage your navigation process over your touch pad. Y se puede a través de ese touch pad. La pantalla se puede manejar la navegación y cuando vas caminando lo traté y vibra al a, él, le digo que está ahí porque está vibrando y era el que se puso parado ahí. I'm telling them that you were standing there when I asked like what's that? Yeah. And the microphone, there is a microphone here. Oh, tiene un micrófono, uh -huh. Mm -hmm. And the turn on turn off button. O abajo la parte en el mango está un poco largo el mango tiene and, para aprender la primera. Tiene una, un speaker, uh -huh. Uh -huh. una magocina. Uh, Lo puedes emparejar con tu smartphone, con tu teléfono. So te puede dar información. Lo puedes, cuando lo emparejas con su teléfono, lo puedes emparejar para que te diga la parada del bus y la, los... Um, You said coffee shops and yes, places? Uh, yes, uh, also, you know, while you are walking in the street, you can get information about the closest restaurants, cafes. Oh, so cuando andas en la calle te puede dar de restaurantes, lugares de restaurantes y, y lugares como cafetería, cafés. Mm -hmm. Wow. And, and also, if you are at the bus stop, you can sí. get information about the bus timeline as well. Okay, so si estás parado en la parada del bus, bus, del autobús, te da horarios o la, te da el nombre del autobús que pase por ahí. That's yeah. great. Yeah. And uh, it's only $500. Yes. Five hundred dollars. Uh, that's that's not bad. Yeah. Well, uh, on w used to be more, right? When it came out. Yeah. Era más, costaba más antes. So cuesta quinientos dólares. www.wewalk.io. You know, you can buy over our website. So www.wewalk.io. Io. Yes. Wewalk.io. Okay. So la la página de internet, chicos, para que lo busquen es www.wewalk. Es w e W-A-L-K.io. I O, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, you're right. So you is this um you send out, outside the country? Uh yes. Uh, and your company is in it based uh, in, in London. Están in in, in in Inglaterra? Yeah. Uh-huh. So you do send Londres. out a, Londres, uh, perdón. Londres, Londres. Yes, Londres. Yes. Londres. Uh -huh. So está fuera de it's it's I'm sweet I'm talking to you in Spanish, I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no so you guys do Sent out of the country, right? Yes, all over the world. Okay. What are, how does the thing about sending things outside of to another country is? Do they have to pay for how much is the handling and shipping or whatever? Yeah. Is there has to be a minimum purchase or? Yeah, 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 no, you know when when they buy the WeWalk, uh, so that then we can ship the their. The cane is not too expensive, right? Four hundred and ninety-nine dollars or five hundred. Compared to all those products that they are selling at the convention, like Orcam, four thousand five hundred, uh, other products that are thousands and thousands, <laughs> and um, at the same time, a cane, a graphite cane, is thirty-five dollars. Marshmallow, fifteen dollars. So we pay a total of fifty dollars. Uh, there is a big difference, right? But but I really think it's worth, you know, uh, having this cane. I know that not for everyone. It's a little heavy because of the touchpad, but I think it's great that it announces, you know, bus lines, the bus schedule, and that is the navigation is with the you know, Google Maps, and you can actually use it uh, just the cane, and, and that you have we have the option to use it with an app. Okay, it's a little big, 
for those who have low vision and uh, don't really use a cane, maybe that, you know, they manage around with whatever side they have or only whenever they find themselves in unfamiliar places and they just carry their cane or very often they use an ID cane. I use my ID cane a lot inside the buildings whenever I go with friends and I'm just going to be in a party and I'm just holding on to to a friend and I don't bring my guide dog. But um, lately, because my guide dog is going to retire soon, uh, I've been um, taking mobility lessons using my graphite cane with the rolling tip. Uh, but I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind having this cane, even if it's a little big. Um, I'm sure they're gonna come up with new um, new updates. I'm sure they will. Uh, I was thinking that the price might be sounds a lot, but maybe not. Not as it's not as expensive as other products. Uh, maybe it's too heavy for those people who have like I don't know carpal tunnel or condition hand condition carrying something that is way too big. I don't know. I didn't try folding it. I wouldn't mind having the cane to do a review and do a video out there, a detailed video for my Spanish uh, speakers, uh, for my Spanish subscribers from Centro South America. A lot of my subscribers are from Centro South America and also from Spain. I wouldn't mind having a cane and do a review just to try it out or do demonstrations when I travel to Mexico. Maybe I'll try to get one. Um, now, for though I was thinking whenever, you know, when I, um, I have retinitis pigmentosa and I started losing my sight gradually when I was almost 19. So it was an age where I was embarrassed to carry a cane. You know, all my friends disappeared. Uh, but um, and being afraid to go out there, I mean, with RP, I could see uh, throughout the years, even through a tunnel vision. But when, for those people that have always shared with me about their situation, that they are at home for a year, two years, three years, four years, and they don't want to, they don't, they're so afraid to go out there. I mean, they watch my videos and they tell me, Anna, I don't even know how you cross the street, how you're out there uh, by yourself all the time. I mean, for me, it, 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 I mean, I live in the United States, uh, streets are accessible, I have a guide dog and I have to do it because if I keep waiting for somebody else to do it for me, <laughs> I can keep waiting. Uh, but for those people who are so afraid to go out there by themselves, I think this smart cane, would be a great option. I believe this would be the, a, a great option. Now, at the beginning, we're embarrassed to use a cane, but you know what? That's what we have. We already have the blindness. Might as well get out there, enjoy life. And if we are able to have these products, I'm so glad these companies actually think about us. I know uh, most of these products are suspensive. Usually, um, companies or agencies, rehab programs pay for it, but I really like the cane. I wouldn't mind having one.